Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is a makeup tutorial for a special holiday which is coming soon and it's Valentine's Day. So I created this um, look that I found inspirational from Instagram that did this beyond beautiful look on the eyes that's inspired from Too Faced of the Chocolate Bar. Um, palette and I used this eyeshadows that the girl used and I just created this look just to make it very special for Valentine's Day this year so if you want to see how I get this look then just keep on watching so let's start off with the eye cream this is a coffee bean caffeine eye cream I don't know what um, exactly what the brand is I actually got this on Birchbox and next I'm going to be using um, a BB cream that's by Maybelline and this is the bronze BB cream and this is the tint light to medium and I'm only using it just to moisturize my face and it's only because I just got tan and I want to give like a nice good glow then for primer I'm just going to use by Too Faced it's the Prime and Poreless Face Primer and what I love about it is it makes it really nice and soft and it's going to make your face really nice and flawless once you apply foundation then I am just going to apply um, then next off, I'm going to use the Born This Way, also by Too Faced Foundation in Natural Beige, along with a, um, the uh, by Cover Girl, also in Natural Beige, and then along with the Lumi Illuminator by L'Oreal, and I believe this is the tint Golden, and I'm just applying all mixed it together and just apply it all over my face as a good combo, and then I'm just use a beauty blender just to blend out the face since I don't have brush strokes. For brows, I'm just going to use by Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in Soft Brown. So I, I did, I just comb up my, my brows and then I just lined it up. And then I used my Brow Powder Duo, also by Anastasia, in Medium Brown just to tint it and to give like a nice good shape. And just to be aware, I really apologize like how my camera, how blurry it is because I have no idea what was going on. I just continued filming and i rather just continue doing it. Then for eyes primer, I am using that's called Master Prime by Maybelline. This is brand new. I've never used it before. I just wanted to try it out and I really loved it. And then I'm just going to use my Dark Circle Corrector by NYX and this is the Tint Orange, which I almost apply almost every day. For Too Faced, I'm just going to use the Chocolate Bar, which I love this palette so much. First, I'm using the color Salted Caramel and I'm just applying it all over the crease with a huge blending brush. Then the next color I'm using, I think, I believe this is called Milk Chocolate. And I'm just going to apply on half of the crease along with Salted Caramel just to give like a good definition. Then to highlight underneath the brow bone, I'm going to use the color Champagne Truffle, which is a very shimmer slash champagne color. And I really love it how it just turns out to give like a nice good highlight. And then on the ba base of my lid, I'm going to use the color Amarita, Amaretto, I believe it's called. And I just love how this color just explodes and how it goes along with the colors that I'm using for this look. For concealer, I am going to use, that's also by Anastasia, in tint 1.5 and I'm only just applying it underneath half of my eyes and I'm going to mix along with these two Pro Longwear concealers by MAC. First, I'm using the NC25 along with the underneath the eyes with the first concealer applied and on the bridge of my nose. Then the other co color, I'm using NW25, just other areas that needs to be con concealed. Then I'm just going to use a fiber brush just to blend out all the concealer and then I'm going to use my beauty blender to blend it nice and softly. For the setting powder, I'm now going to use the NARS. This is translucent setting powder, which is translucent crystal. And I'm only applying it um, where I put all over the concealer. 
Then I'm using the Kat Von D shade to light and I'm using these two mixed colors. One is Lyric and I forgot the other name. So I'm just I'm using these two as a good combo and just apply it along with the translucent powder that I applied earlier. For powder, you know how I use my Bobbi Bobbi Brown, the Sheer Finish Compressed Powder in Soft Honey, which you know this color has been sold out in stores like nonstop. I'm not lying, you guys. It's amazing, and I love the color. It turns out, especially since I'm very light um, to medium skin. Then for bronzer, I'm going to use also by Bobbi Brown, and it's called Golden Light. And I'm only just applying it on on the half of my sides of my cheekbones, sides of my forehead, in the middle of the forehead, and on the bottom of my neck along with the cheekbones and also on the bridge of my nose. For the metalized skin finish, it's by MAC. I'm using this color, just only just applying on, on the bronzer that I applied on the cheeks earlier. Then I'm using this banana powder, which is one of the best highlight highlighting powders I've ever used just to cut out the conceal, um, the bronzer, just to make a nice flush cut. And I'm only applying it on the cheeks, how I normally do it. Then I'm using my blush palette, that's by BH Cosmetics, using with this plum pinkish color. And after that, I'm using the highlighter that is by Becca, and it's called Moonstone, which, oh my god, you guys, it's amazing. And it gives, like, a nice, good highlight, and like I said, it pops, like, right onto your face. And I, I don't know how much to describe it. This is the best highlighter I've ever used, especially that's by Becca, and I love it. And I'm just only blending out everything I just applied, along with highlight, bronzing, you know how that is. For liquid eyeliner, I'm using that's by NYX, and this is the called the Curve. And it's a weird shape, but I love how this marker turns out just to make a nice good wing on your eye. But instead of filling it in with this marker, marker, unfortunately, I'm going to use the Ultra Liner by Maybelline, which I love so much that I've been using for years and years and years. And it is very, it is waterproof, which I love. Then I'm using this. Um, Eye pencil that is by Urban Decay and it's a 24/7 double glided um, eye pencil and it's from the Naked 3 edition. I forgot the name of the colors which I put in the description box. Now going back to the eye, I am now going to use the final color which is Cherry Cordial and I'm only applying it on the inner and outer lid just to give like a nice good pop. And then just to um, add some color on the inner corner and underneath my waterline I am now going to use champagne truffle like I used earlier that I highlight underneath the brow and for my waterline I'm just going to apply just a little bit with that color and a good mix with the other colors that I use that is cherry cordial, self, the salted caramel and milk chocolate. To prime the lashes, I'm using my Smashbox, Smashbox lash, Last Lashing Primer and also I'm using this CoverGirl Plumbing Lash Mascara that I've never used before and I've been loving it so far only because the brush is super thick and I love how it turns out. And for the lashes, I'm going to use it's by Kicks. Kiss, sorry. They're like the natural falsy lashes that I love that I almost use every day. And I'm just going to just apply it with both of my lashes to give like a nice good definition, especially for Valentine's Day, just to give like a nice good natural look. For the brows, 
I'm gonna use the Gimme Brow Gel Brow Gel that's by Benefit. I'm sorry this is really small because I only this is like the only sample I have, but I still love it because it's so cute and it's by light to medium tint. Now for the lips, I'm gonna use that's by NYX and it's in the shade natural. So you can see here I'm just applying, I'm just gonna line the lips and just fill it in most of the um, the color I can just to give like a nice good shade. And then for lipstick, it's also by NYX and it's a soft matte lipstick and this is in the color Minimalism, which I know it's really, really, really pink, but I just applied um, going back to the lip liner just to give like a nice, good nude shade. Then for lip gloss, it's also by NYX. I'm like all, all about that NYX, right? It's the Butter Gloss and this is in the shade um, Tiramisu, which is like a dark Pink, pinkish color and it gives like a nice good glow to it and there you have it. That is it for this video. Hope you guys really did enjoy it. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Of course, follow me in the media that's down below in the description box. You know how it is. And again, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I will talk to you guys later. Oh, my.